Hey everyone, Duck Bear here. And today, I'm going to be filling in for PJ since he seems to have mysteriously disappeared. So today, we are going to look at a subreddit called Insane People Facebook. A subreddit that PJ has already covered in the past. So without further ado, let's get the show on the road. Bend Oregon, System Reset Experience. Your journey to trans... Dot 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 at eventbrite.com can any of my Christian friends tell me if this resort is demonic? It sounds amazing to me. They mention yoga and the practice. I'd love to go, but cannot participate in anything that might invoke spirits. Wait a second. Is that person doing yoga? Oh no! The gates of hell have been opened! Hi. Has anyone here tried to vape with urine for the lungs? Oh god, I can't. Hang on, I, I, I'll be right back. Ben Ben is all at Ivermectin to save all lives, are also proven to kill cancer. The bioweapons are parasites, fourth quadrant cerebral cortex nerve effectively gelding and or driving from the body. Insanity! So a demon can take charge, earworms, 5G radiation also follows weather manipulation, worse than virus as the impulses control the mRNA molecules in the cells that are reprogramming DNA. Find the towers near you. Go for them. Then shield 5.1. They, the legions who hate Jesus, are trying to wipe out God's creation again. Still, charcoal absorbs poison. No weapon formed against us shall prosper. By God, you've cracked the case. The worst shit I've ever seen is the LGBTQ community and those assholes who support it. This is literally worse than a terrorist country or any other dark shit. Yeah, the gay agenda is worse than terrorism. Remember 9-11 and how millions of people died on that day? No, it wasn't because of a plane crashing into a building. It was because of gays. Heard the news about Kayla committing suicide today? I knew her from high school, and yes, it's tragic and sad. But as people know, I'm not going to shy away from saying what I truly feel and being honest. Because honesty is one of my most important attributes, and this circumstance is no different. I feel like maybe if she was with someone better and someone who looked after her, for example, moi, maybe she wouldn't have took her own life so young. I had previously tried to get her to go on various dates with me, but sadly, got rejected numerous times. This hurt, but I never gave up. So, why did she? If she had given me the chance, maybe things would have turned out differently. Maybe I could have been her savior. In the end, I guess we'll never know. Yeah, I know this person committed suicide and it's really tragic, but I'm gonna make this all about me because I'm the main character. And yes, I do have a Joker poster in my room, thank you for noticing. Please share! As I went to KFC on West Liberty, I ate my food on the way home, got to the bottom of my Diet Pepsi, and the cup caught my attention. Well, I told Jess to Google this game. As you can see in the photos, it's a game about HELL! And this is being advertised through Pepsi on KFC! It's one thing to drink beer and liquor, cause, you know, it's full of spirits, but to get a drink from a fast food chain, and THIS is on there! That's also the wrong there, by the way. I can't express this enough, more and more and more. We need a Christian school in Morgan County! We see Satan attacking our children through these games! They become reality to some, and we wonder why there are these skull shootings, and all these young people going and being demonized. We must start fighting back in our county! It starts with you! Then it will bleed over to other counties. It's time to take action with our kids and get a school going to teach our kids how big our God is! Thank you for listening and sharing. God bless everyone and pray over everything. Love you all! By God, you've cracked the case! Survey of just over first 1,000 person contracting the pox and it revealed 95% were transmitted via homosexual anal sex. It takes a special kind of person to be proud of having disease-ridden fecal matter sex and expressing your desire to share. Stop it. Get some help. We have a problem. Chick-fil-A just hired a VP of diversity, equality, and inclusion. This is bad. Very bad. I don't want to have a boycott. Are we going to have a boycott? It's only a matter of time before they start putting tranny semen in the frosted lemonade at this point. What the hell is this guy even talking about? Happy Pride Month! Mutilating kids, castrating kids, sterilizing kids, brainwashing kids, grooming kids, radicalizing kids, nothing to be proud of. Boycott Pride Month and any company supporting these crimes! 
I really hope that doesn't get taken out of context, because if it does, I am cancelled. Also, I'm just now realizing that this person is a doctor, and truthfully, that's very concerning. Donald Trump is a time traveler! Go watch Back to the Future 2. He and military can travel between realities using the space-time continuum! Tesla, Navy, etc! By God! You've cracked the case! Today is the 888th day of zero regrets for the unjab. Congratulations to you all! Legends! And you're gonna take that title to the very grave... ...in the next three minutes. Is the reason Democrats want to destroy America revenge for taking away their slaves? Just asking. What. The f Do I even need to- uh, Do I even need to explain what's wrong with this? Like, if you think this is an okay thing to write, or post on Facebook, you deserve to be hit with a stick. I'm so glad that I went and had a baby before they started sterilizing everyone. Not to mention that 500% increase in AIDS! Eight different strands, I heard! I'm assuming this is about the anti-vax movement. He stabbed my daughter four times and broke her head in four places. He should suffer the same painful death as my daughter, Father Asakshi. Justice cannot be provided because the nation lost a daughter. The only thing we can do is kill all Muslims and declare India as a Hindu country. His words, not mine. If not done, we'll lose more sisters, daughters, and mothers. We shall stand against injustice and the rapid expansion of Muslim population in India before this country becomes a Muslim nation where women aren't allowed to survive. Again, his words, not mine. And I'm gonna leave it right there because this subreddit sure is a doozy. I think Pedro would say something like, So what do you guys think? Let me know in the comments. Stuff like that, blah blah blah. I sure hope he comes back soon. Turns off look quiet without him. But I hope you enjoyed the video anyway. Peace out. You ain't never gonna slow me down, cause I feel alive now.